opening day optimism quickly disappears in defeat. What better way to revive hope than with a victory against your closest rivals? Burton will be wary of making the same mistake twice after last season failing to win in their opening eight league games, winning only one point in the process. Derby will be ultra aware of the recent history against Albion too. They have never won at Burton in three previous visits. Oshilaja and Caprice both starting today for Burton. Mendes Lang back for Derby. Derby with the early ball into the penalty area, which is dealt with. But they've got some more work to do at the back here as Derby continue to apply the pressure. And Sweeney has conceded the free kick for this challenge here. And as Lang is the one I'd be watching for. While well, he was waiting on the edge of the area, but the ball came in towards the front post. And James Collins opens his account for the season with a big header. After what was an excellent free kick from Connor Harahan. Nobody could deal with the leap at the front post from James Collins and it takes just seven minutes for Derby to go ahead. Huge throw in from Nelson, comes straight back, but it's back up into the penalty area and more problems here for Burton, who are saved by their goalkeeper Jamal Blackman who stretches across. It's been a really slow start here by the home side. Problems for Dino Mamria. And they were very nearly opened up again here. Laid off by Collins. They just couldn't take advantage though. That's a clever touch. Sprinting forward here on the right-hand side, Caprice onto Helms' ball. And he's done really well. Cut back to the edge of the area where Harper was waiting. There's the volley. Well, it's better from Burton, but it's still wide of the target. Build up really good. Caprice right at the heart of things. But Powell just couldn't keep this one down. And over the top it sails. Perhaps the header that Forsyth was looking for. And Wildsmith can't deal with that and has conceded the corner. An opportunity gifted to them here for Burton, who will look to equalise. Plenty of yellow shirts up as they race towards the ball and make rather a mess of it. Two really good chances to score. Brayford with the first. Not sure what he was doing as he tried to connect with this one at the far post. It dropped ever so kindly though for Sam Hughes, who couldn't finish either. Caprice forced out of play, but he's taking the throw quickly. And Oshelaja has battled to win it. Caprice angles the ball towards the back of the area. Good looking delivery, but dealt with by Derby. Well, it should have been dealt with. Hesitation from Will Smith, and he was very nearly punished. He gets very, very lucky. Why did he wait? Well, it will be a free kick to Burton. The referee has had to step in to intervene after this challenge that came here. Mendes Lang is penalised. Powell, centre the back of the area. And it's a header that will drop straight into the arms of Wildsmith. 
Both Hughes and Brayford were free at the back of the area. They were the two targets. No trouble, though, here for Derby. Seddon to the back of the penalty area where plenty were waiting. It doesn't quite drop for Harper, makes a bit of a meal of it. And that means that Derby can break away. And here comes Birds, who's seen Mendes Lang racing away here. Mendes Lang, well, he snatches at that one ever so slightly, dragged it wide, was really well positioned and brilliantly found too by Max Birds. Birds saw the run. Mendes Lang had the speed. Caprice was back there and maybe did just about enough to force the attacker wide. Well, Burton need to try and find a route back into this game pretty quickly. They were better after the goal, and that's the challenge. Although they have some defending to do here as Mendes Lang again bursts free up into the area. And this time is stopped by Jamal Blackman, who pushes away for a corner. Two swift breaks in quick succession. Two good chances for Nathaniel Mendes Lang. Couldn't convert either. Good stop this time by Burton's keeper, Blackman. Well, Burton need to try their best here to get themselves into an attacking position all too easily, allowing Mendes Lang in. And here he goes again into the penalty area to lay off. And Bird has somehow failed to connect. Well, they may just live to regret these chances, Starby. And Burton instantly will look for a breakaway here. Trying to slip the ball in behind. Gordon, the new boy, couldn't get there. Mendes Lang looking to turn provider this time, did everything right. But with the goal waiting, Max Bird just didn't connect. Bird. Harahan breaking speed to try and come up in support. He connects. And finally, Derby have the second goal that they have been threatening to score for most of the second half. It will be their afternoon unless something crazy happens because Burton haven't provided enough resistance. And Connor Harahan is there to score a fabulous strike, swept up beyond goalkeeper Blackman to make it Burton nil, Derby two. Loose pass all the way across the back line and they may just be in again here Derby looking to punish looking for goal three Connor Washington there opens his account for Derby and takes advantage of some awful defending from Burton there was even a chance to clear after what was a really crazy back pass all the way across the heart of their defence the passing here intricate, Wards shifting the ball on, Waghorn into Washington. Well, it's Derby who get the bragging rights in the, Dar in the Derby match. And it's Derby who get their first win of the season in convincing style here. Collins started proceedings in the first half. And then in the second half, when well, they could have had so many more, they added two more to their tally. Harahan and Washington with those. And it finishes Burton nil, Derby three.